Hey all us loving universe, it's Xander and welcome back to WWE 2K Universe Mode. We're here for NXT tonight. We've got the second round of the Cruiserweight Championship Tournament and we got Pete Dunne versus Tyler Bate. So here we go with this matchup. With the second round of the Cruiserweight Championship Tournament. So we already had four matches in this Cruiserweight Championship Tournament, an eight-man tournament. We started this tournament, Tyler Breeze, Akira Tozawa, Cedric Alexander, Mansoor, Tony Nese, Arya Davari, Ricochet, and Noam Dar. We're now into round two. Cedric Alexander, Tony Nese, Ricochet, and Tyler Breeze remain. By the end of tonight, only two of those four men will remain and they will face off in a number one contenders match to the NXT Cruiserweight Championship where the winner will take on Johnny Gargano at January's NXT TakeOver in just two weeks. How did that happen? How did we get that close that fast? It does not feel like that long ago that Ray and I got back together to talk about NXT TakeOver in Chicago. Either way, here comes Here comes the premier athlete, Tony Nice. It's Tony Nice making his way to the ring. Come over here. Come here, I want to show you something. Of course Tony Nice very, very proud of himself. Very proud of his body here. Tony Nese with a. One, two, three, and he's got, four, got a lot of abs, doesn't he? Seven, eight. That's eight reasons why I'm the premier athlete. Eight reasons why I'm better than each and every one of you. Well, Tony Nese, as I said, very, very full of himself, clearly. He's making his way to the ring, though. So Tony Nese, Cedric Alexander, one of these two men faces off moves on to the finals to face the winner of our main event. And that matchup will be next week, of course. So here we go, it's Cedric and Tony. And they're going to lock up. Tony's got the arm. Cedric finds the counter, though. And Cedric has the arm of Tony Nice. And now Tony Nice counters. Tony has the head of Cedric. Grabs him by the head. And takes him down. Cedric now having his head wrenched back on by Tony Nice. And Tony Nees with a right hand to Cedric. Spinning wheel kick. No, a counter from Tony Nees. And Tony Nees has Cedric Alexander. Cedric counters, kicks him in the ribs. And Cedric Alexander takes him down. Takes him up now. Cedric, super kick. And Alexander went for an elbow drop. Tony Nees out of the way. And Tony Nees. Whoa, Cedric counters. And Cedric rolls him through into a cover. One, two, oh! Tony Nese was nearly eliminated from the tournament. Cedric Alexander takes him down. Cedric picking him back up, and Cedric Alexander spinning backhand. That grabs Tony Nese, sends him off the ropes, and Cedric takes down Tony Nese and kicks him. And elbow drop. And now Tony Nese with an arm drag. Takes down Cedric. And a right hand from Tony. Cedric rolls back to his feet. And Cedric takes him down again. Tony Nese pulls himself up into the ropes though. And Tony Nese up in the ropes. Cedric Alexander dumps him out of the ring. And now Cedric up to the top. And Cedric drive, dives down onto Tony Nese. And now Cedric with Tony Nese across the steps. Three. Referee a three count now. Tony Nese, he's got to get back in before the count of ten. Will he be able to? Five count. And here we go. Tony Nese back in the ring. And Tony Nese now takes down Cedric. And Tony Nese working over the neck 
of Alexander. Wrenches back on it. And now Tony Nace. No! Right hand from Cedric. And Cedric counters. Cedric takes him down. Cover. One. Two. Kick out from Tony Nace. And oh! Springboard Moonsault didn't quite get him though. Tony Nese trying to pull himself back up to his feet. It's now Cedric. Oh! Slingshot takes him down with another flatliner. He kicks back up to his feet. That springboard moonsault connected. And so did that one. And now Tony Nese in some trouble here. Cedric's got the arm. Oh, but Tony Nese getting back up to his feet. And Tony Nese, right hand knocks him back. And Tony Nese... Grabs Cedric, throws him in the corner, and clotheslines him. Taking him back up to his feet now, and Cedric gets caught by Tony Nace, and Tony Nace kicking him in the ribs. And Tony Nace, oh, has Cedric. Oh, look at that. Cedric went down with a thud. As he gets kicked down by Tony. And Tony Nace now with a kick to the head of Cedric. Back up to his feet and Tony Nace. Oh, ducks a clothesline. Oh, kicks him in the ribs. Knee strike and another kick and sweeps the leg. And Cedric Alexander ducks out of the ring. Really falls out of the ring more than anything there. As here comes Tony Nace. And Cedric caught him. Discus clothesline. A discus clothesline from Cedric there. Grabs Tony, throws him back in the ring. And Cedric Alexander grabs him. Lumbar check connects from Cedric. Cover. And just like that, two. Cedric Alexander is going to the finals. That is a huge win for Cedric. In the end, Cedric Alexander, well, that's one down. We still got our main event to come later tonight, but as I advertised earlier, up next will be Tyler Bate versus Pete Dunn. But also, we got to see what else happened on NXT tonight. But a huge win for Cedric Alexander first off there. What a way to kick off NXT tonight. So we've got one half of our finals. Cedric Alexander just soaking up the glory. He is one step away. From challenging for the Cruiserweight Championship at NXT TakeOver. Had our open contest just now, of course. NXT Women's Champion Rhea Ripley knocked off Eva Marie. Insanity Incarnated, the number one contenders for the NXT Tag Team Championships, knocked off Imperium. As I said, up next is Pete Dunne versus Tyler Bate in the main event. A takeover rematch, a semi-final match of the Cruiserweight Tournament, Tyler Breeze and Ricochet. Well, out first in our next matchup. Is the man who will be challenging Cesaro at TakeOver for the NXT UK Championship. A man who desperately needs a win right now in the Bruiserweight. He knocked off former NXT North American Champion Alexander Wolf a few weeks ago. But he desperately needs another big win. Pete Dunne, after his loss to Adam Cole at TakeOver... It's, it's not been going well for Dunn. So Dunn makes his way to the ring. And he's going to be taking on the heart of the UK. One half of Mustache Mountain. He's taking on Tyler Bate. Tyler Bate, you know, he'd love, a, he'd love an opportunity to challenge for the UK Championship again. 
He took Volter to the limit when Volter was the NXT UK champion. Well, Volter, speaking of him, you know, he's been turning his attention towards the NXT championship proper. So, who knows? That's Tyler Bate making his way to the ring. So, Bate and Dunn, one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, boy, we're actually doing this. Here we bloody go. And Bate starts it off with a knee strike. Dunn. And Dunn. Well, here we go. Now we lock up. It's Tyler pushing Pete into the ropes. Referee going to try and get, get between them. And he does. As Pete Dunn takes down Tyler Bate. And now Tyler Bate rolls Pete Dunn through. Cover. One. Two. Pete Dunn kicks out. And now Tyler Bate goes for a kick. Pete Dunn counters. Pete Dunn grabs Tyler Bate. Has him up, suplexes him down into a cover. One. Two. No, Tyler Bate kicks out. Pete Dunn, kick to the back, Tyler Bate up to his feet. Bate goes for a kick, Dunn counters. Dunn, no, gets caught by Bate, and Bate, look at the strength here, the big strong boy! And now Tyler Bate, oh, taking down Pete Dunn. And now Bate picking Dunn back up to his feet. And Bate went for a right, Pete Dunn catches him with a shot to the ribs. And Pete Dunn, oh, pulling back on the nose of Bate. That is completely against the rules here. As now he's working over the neck and a, oh, a kick to the back of the neck. And now he's got him back up to his feet. And Pete Dunn kicking the ribs. And Pete Dunn. Oh, Tyler Bate slips out of it. And Tyler Bate. Oh, Pete Dunn has him up on his shoulders now. And Pete Dunn bounces Tyler Bate off the ropes. Grabs him now and has him by the ankle and a knee strike to the ankle. Pete Dunn looking to, looking to break the ankle of his of Tyler Bate. They're teammates though. They're part of British Strong Style together. Oh, but Pete Dunn. Triangle choke it looks like. Yes, a triangle choke is in on Tyler Bate. Who is going to quickly try and slip out of it. But instead of slip out, he picks up Pete Dunn and power bombs him. As Bate struggles back to his feet. Went for a right. Dunn caught him. Dunn puts him in the corner. Dunn! Oh, went for an Enzigari. And now Tyler Bate going up to the top rope. Bate up top. Dunn with a right. Dunn with another. And another. Dunn knocks Bate off the ropes. And now Pete Dunn grabs Tyler Bate. Drags him away from the ropes. And Pete Dunn. Cover on Tyler. One. Two. No. Tyler Bate kicks out. Pete Dunn now, headlock on Tyler. Working over the neck of Tyler Bate. And Tyler Bate now, up to his feet. And Pete Dunn now, whoa, gets caught by Bate who takes him down. And now Tyler Bate, taking Pete Dunn back up to his feet. And Tyler Bate chops him. Pete Dunn now grabs him. Pete Dunn throws him in the corner. Dunn with a kick. And Tyler Bate staggers down to the mat. Dunn turns him over. Now Pete Dunn. And the strength here of Dunn. Dead, dead lifts Bate into a powerbomb. And now, oh, kick to the head from Tyler Bate. Tyler Bate kicks Pete Dunn in the head. And Dunn, covered by Bate. One, two, kick out. And a kick out from Pete Dunn. Tyler Bate going up to the top, and Tyler Bate. Whoa! Corkscrews off the top. Covers Pete Dunn. One, two, another kick out. And now Bate picks up Dunn. Dunn up to his feet, and Pete Dunn kicked in the ribs by Bate. Bate gets caught with a right. Tyler Bate, oh, kicked in the ribs. Pete Dunn picks him up, drops him. Cover! One, two, no. And now Pete Dunn has Bate. Bate sweeps the leg. 
And now Tyler Bate. Grabs Pete Dunn. Picks him up. Tyler Bate. Oh, went for the kick. I think he was going to set up Tyler Driver 97. Pete Dunn. Cloverleaf locked in. A Cloverleaf is locked in on Bate. And then Tyler Bate managed to slip out of it. Kicks Pete Dunn down. What a counter from Tyler. And now Tyler Bate going up top. And Tyler Bate, top rope. Pete Dunn with a right. Pete Dunn, no. Tyler Bate counters. Pete Dunn in trouble. Tyler Bate, crossbody. Cover. One. Two. Tyler Bate not able to put him away. Bate now. Off the ropes. Neck breaker to Pete Dunn. Picks Pete Dunn back up now. And Tyler Bate. Right hand. And went for another. Pete Dunn counters. Pete Dunn. Kick to the ribs of Bate. Pete Dunn has Bate up again. And Pete Dunn drops him. Cover again from Dunn. One. Two. Oh, Tyler Bate. Shoulder up at two. But now this could be, well, the very fitting, bitter end. One, two, three. And the Bruiserweight beats Tyler Bates. And just like that, a great showing from both guys tonight. No love lost. I'm sure the friendship probably still intact, I would think. But in the end, the bitter end puts away Tyler Bate. And Pete Dunn gets, as I said, a much-needed victory. That's not all we've got tonight, though, because, ladies and gentlemen, up next, it's the other semifinal match in the Cruiserweight Championship Tournament. It's an NXT TakeOver Chicago rematch as Tyler Breeze takes on Ricochet. It is a main event time. As here comes Prince Pretty himself. His associate Mandy Rose accompanying him to the ring. Here comes Tyler Breeze. It's a big night for Tyler Breeze. He's one step away. Much like I said about Cedric Alexander and Tony Nese. Both Tyler Breeze and Ricochet are only one step away from a cruiserweight championship matchup. The winner of this matchup faces Cedric Alexander next week. The winner gets Johnny Gargano at TakeOver. Tyler Breeze makes his way to the ring. Prince Pretty has arrived. But here comes his opponent. Ricochet. Big night for Ricochet as well. Remember, I've said it before, I'll say it again. Ricochet has been on a roll since his return to NXT. He was traded from Raw to NXT in a post SummerSlam draft. Oh! Well, Ricochet was going to do that flip off the ropes. Oh, and he takes down Breeze. Saw him coming. Breeze. Punched Ricochet in the back of the head in the dark. He couldn't quite make it out. I could see it just from my position at the commentary table. But now Breeze. Oh, Breeze now jumping Ricochet. 
And Ricochet grabbed by Breeze as Breeze knee strike takes him down. And Tyler Breeze, oh, Ricochet with a clothesline. Goes for a kick to the back, and Tyler Breeze. Ricochet hasn't even gotten his coat off. And look at the wings on that thing. He's made some bad memories seeing a black trench coat with a wing. Sorry. Now Breeze stomps on Ricochet. Ricochet back into the ring, and Ricochet gets caught by Breeze. Breeze plants him with a DDT. Tyler Breeze, well, now he's saying he's the real... He's the real superstar of this matchup. As he goes for a right hand to the back of Ricochet. Breeze. Right hand again. Breeze counter. Knocking him back. Ricochet. And the one and only is in trouble. Oh! Runs straight into a knee from Tyler. And now Tyler Breeze kicking away on Ricochet. Doing it again as well just for good measure. And Tyler Breeze. Mugging Ricochet at this point. Ricochet up to his feet. Oh, Tyler Breeze caught him with a chop. Ricochet with an uppercut. Ricochet grabs Tyler now, and Ricochet throws him in the corner. Ricochet, oh, went for the drop kick. Breeze out of the way. Ricochet now, DDT to Breeze. And kicks right back up off of it. And now Ricochet grabs Tyler. Drags him away from the ropes. Ricochet, cover on Breeze. One, two, no, Tyler kicks out. Tyler back to his feet. Chop to Ricochet. Supermodel kick. And now Breeze. Right hand to Ricochet. Breeze. I went for another right. Got caught. Breeze. No, Ricochet counters. And now Ricochet with Breeze into the corner. Forearm strike takes him down. Breeze, I think he was going to get ready for the unprettier, but Ricochet came back too way too quickly for Breeze. Down goes Tyler again. Tyler Breeze is down. Down he goes. Turns him over now with a kick. And a knee to the back. And now Ricochet drags Breeze away from the ropes. Turns him over. Ricochet. Cover on Breeze. Into the cover now. One. Two. No. Tyler Breeze. Oh, grabbed by Ricochet. Ricochet throws him in the corner. And Ricochet. Oh, went for a crossbody. Breeze out of the way. Ricochet! Well, a cutter. Remember, it was Ricochet knocking off Tyler Breeze at TakeOver, but Tyler Breeze got the win in their first encounter. But now Ricochet up to the top. What's Ricochet thinking? Ricochet. Shooting star press. Down goes Tyler. Ricochet now picking him up to his feet, and Ricochet grabs Breeze, but Breeze puts him in the corner, and Breeze with Ricochet. Hung up on the ropes. Breeze. With a neck breaker to Ricochet. And now Tyler Breeze, here we go. Standing over him. Ricochet in trouble. Breeze grabs him. Unprettier. Cover. One. Two. Oh! A kick out from Ricochet. Well, Tyler goes for a kick. Kicks Ricochet again. Ricochet somehow kicked out of the unprettier. And now Ricochet head scissor takedown to Tyler. And Tyler Breeze going to duck under the bottom rope now. And Ricochet now watches him. Ricochet. Whoa. Tyler Breeze counters. Breeze going up top. What's Tyler going to think here? Tyler off the top gets caught with a power slam. And now you can see Mandy Rose trying to give Tyler a pep talk from the outside, but Ricochet takes him down. Ricochet now. Cover on Breeze. One. Two. No. Tyler gets the shoulder up. And now Tyler Breeze is in trouble as Ricochet turns him over. And Ricochet. As Tyler Breeze. Ricochet. Going after the arm and takes out the arm of Tyler. Ricochet now kicks him and turns him over. Ricochet. Well, here we go. He's going to look to fly. Here we go. Ricochet. There it is. 6.30 Centon. Good night, sweet prince. One, two, three. So next week, 
It will be Ricochet versus Cedric Alexander. Ricochet gets the win over Breeze tonight in the TakeOver rematch. Breeze, I thought he had it won a couple times, but in the end, Ricochet managed to put him away. Took him down. 6.30 cents on. It's all she wrote. Ricochet is your winner. Thank you all for watching tonight's episode of NXT. I'll see you all in SmackDown, the final episode before TLC. I've been Xander, and that was Universe.